There are uh, certain indications that the virus may be weakening, but this is very much speculation, there's no hard evidence for it. Um, it's based on the fact that it appears uh, that the latter part of the epidemic globally, in other words on the African continent for example, uh, that the severity of the disease appears to be less. Now it may be due to the age spectrum, for example, in the developing world, uh, but there may be some indication that the virus may be weakening. Uh, there are some, also some genetic markers in the genome of the virus, which may indicate that the virus is, uh, is weakening in its virulence, but is becoming more transmissible. And this is how, in fact, viruses, generally speaking, and this is a very much a generalization, that viruses do tend to reduce their virulence and increase their transmissibility. Because obviously it's in the virus's interest, we're talking teleologically, purpose-wise, uh, that the virus would want to, in fact, not cause severe disease. It wants to spread amongst people. Uh, so this, this may be happening with COVID. It's, it's very early to tell. There's no hard evidence for it. This is speculation at the moment. Um, but you know, if you look at the human coronavirus, there are four human coronaviruses which are entrenched in humanity. And they cause a common cold and also mild gastroenteritis. Uh, and those four viruses have been in humanity for forever. Um, and it may well be that these more severe coronaviruses, the one, the original SARS CoV virus of 2003, the MERS CoV virus of 2012, that they in fact uh, were, come from the animal, animal reservoir, probably bats, uh, try to entrench themselves in humans that weren't successful. But this particular one, SARS-CoV-2, has become successful. It's, come from, it's uh, come from an animal, it's what we call a zoonosis, from an animal reservoir, presumably the bat, come into the human population and has succeeded because it's much less virulent than those other SARS-CoV viruses. Uh, less virulent, but obviously more transmissible than those. Those died out. This obviously hasn't died out. So it may be circulating in the human population now, uh, eventually weakening and eventually becoming an entrenched human virus. Whether it will be seasonal, uh, it probably will because the other, you know, if you take as a model the other human coronaviruses, it may be seasonal.